Jim, I'm thinking about, you know, Charlie's gone 10 years already. Do you know what I mean? Yes. Yes, I've uh, been quite a while, huh? I mean, it's incredible how... It was, uh, that would be my brother, too, because they died the same year. When did Floyd go? He went uh, in June, and Charlie was May, right? Yeah, yeah, that's it. Yeah. No, Charlie was tomorrow, 10 years ago. Oh, July. Well, he was, then he uh, died after. Yeah. Uh, June, uh, I think Floyd died in June. Yeah. I just can't believe 10 years went by already, you know? Yeah. And, yeah. You know. It just bothers me because all the time is going by and I'm out here with my family and they're just, you know, after a while I can't take on all their complications, you know what I mean, Jim? Right. What happened to Woodstock? Did that all fizzle out? I don't know. Tell me. Well, it fizzled out in Watkins Glen, but I don't know about down the other place. Well... I wish I could take a train out there. It'll take me three days to get there, stay a couple of nights, take some photos, get on the train, come back, you know? Mm -hmm. But um, what is going on with that? I thought it was going to be some some well, sort of big know. thing. I don't know. It's probably down you where you find your computer, but I'm sure the one they, they're going to have in Watkins Glen, that <clears throat> is off. But then the one, you know, down where you went. Well, the one I was at is the original. Right. That's right. in Woodstock. I haven't, I haven't heard about that one again. I bet you they're going to just be there, you know what I mean? Right. Um, um, how many miles is that from New Monticello, White Lake? About 30? Oh, I think it's more than that. Probably 50. Mm-hmm. Yeah, from here. I just, sometimes I tell you I want to take a break so bad. I just want to get on the train, take a ride. You know what I mean, Jim? And rent the car or something and just get the hell around there. It's just so many years I'm out here. Right. Nothing's going good, you know? Right. But how are you doing? Seventy what? Seven. Oh man. Yeah, you're getting up there too. You and your what? Sixty six. I'll be sixty seven. Okay, then it's ten years difference. So you're ten years and one month ahead of me. Mm -hmm. But you you're feeling okay? You don't feel any problems or Well, I have a sleep apnea, I guess you know that. You told me, yeah. because they didn't like the numbers. And so I went over to the hospital this last week and I didn't sleep a wink, I don't think. And I just didn't sleep that night. <laughs> what does it do? What do you feel like? Well, they wear you all up. Um, they run wire down your pajamas and on your legs.
Well, what did they prove with that? They prove how your, you know, your brain waves are working when you're sleeping, if you sleep, <laughs> you know. I mean, since I didn't sleep, just a little, she said, they couldn't get a good reading, so I'll probably have to go back for it. I heard they pay you for these things. Is that true? Oh, no. <laughs> no, they, um, the, uh, insurance. You know how much they get per night doing that? I don't know. 2,600 bucks. Who gets that? The insurance has to pay that out, my insurance. Oh, my God. It's a sleep lab, that's what it is. The 